Timothy Chalamet dumped Kylie Jenner after seven months of dating. Are Kylie and Timmy doing okay? Because it seems like there might be some secrecy going on, especially as fans have been convinced that they are no longer together. Fans have recently noticed some suspicious signs that the couple may have abruptly called it quits. And perhaps Kylie is even low-key trying to get back together with her baby daddy. Yes, no, not me. Travis Scott. I'm obsessed with it. It seems like Kylie Jenner and Timothy Chalamet are pulling what I would call a... Uh, Chris Angel worthy disappearing act from the public lately. Maybe Kate Middleton worthy? Uh, who knows, that's a topic for another time. But the lovely A-list duo were recently caught sneaking into an ice cream shop where Timmy was decked out in a mask, sort of like Kanye West style. It looked like he was trying to fly under the radar. A little, yeah, a little bit of pressure, a little bit of pressure to, to see it through. In a photo that was shared on Instagram, only Timothy dared to face the camera, where he was rocking the black mask that covered everything but his eyes and typical Kanye style and it looked like, I don't know, some sort of mysterious hoodie. But speculation has been in the air on whether or not these two are still together. Especially after the rumors were flying around surrounding whether or not Timothy was having a secret fling while on set filming for Dune 2. Nothing's clear. This led to further speculation regarding who Kylie Jenner was moving on to next, with a large chunk of her fans believing that a one-way ticket to Astro World was imminent. However, it seems pretty obvious that the reason we haven't been hearing about Kylie and uh, Timothy uh, is, is mostly due to Timothy not wanting to have to deal with the spotlight. It also seems that perhaps Kylie Jenner has been feeling similarly, as she was the one who turned away from the camera in her creamy colored hood and a sleek little black leather jacket as well as a nice brown tote bag over her shoulder. I feel like that normal is very boring. A lot of the speculation regarding this couple comes from the fact that Kylie was recently at the Oscars after party with her mom Chris and her sisters Kendall and Kim, yet there was no sign of Timothy. So either Timothy was just taking the night off or he really just doesn't care for the spotlight these days. Either way, he was a no-show and fans were starting to question the legitimacy of his relationship with Kylie. Kylie recently did an interview with the New York Times to which she was asked if her recent ways of fashion had anything to do with a potential breakup with Timothy. To which Kylie answered in a relatively blunt manner saying, I just don't want to talk about personal things. So this quote along with the paparazzi dodging and all the rumors about Timothy trying to shy away from the spotlight and Kylie going back to Travis have all come together to lead people towards the breakup conclusion. And whether or not that's true, there seems to be some stuff that's still up in the air, especially regarding the state of their relationship. Was the ice cream visit a date? Or was it just a simple catch up between friends? Was it a random encounter where it's like, oh my God, you're here. I'm here too. Or hold on a second. What is Timothy's favorite ice cream flavor? Is it mint chocolate chip? It must be. I need to know. Either way, some of their media outings have been on the lovey-dovey side recently, and since the breakup speculation with all of this stuff had Kylie and Timothy being together, people are confused because Kylie and Timothy were at the Golden Globes just a couple months ago back in January, where they were cuddling and kissing and whispering sweet poems to each other, I would assume. Anyways, recently, Timothy seems pretty happy, especially since the reviews surrounding his latest blockbuster Dune number 2 have been pretty off the charts with an 8.9 on IMDb and a 92% on Rotten Tomatoes at the time that this video is being filmed. And after just 10 days in theaters, Dune Part 2 has earned nearly 500 a million in the box office, which already surpassed the entire box office earnings of Dune 1, which raked in just 100 million. Although the original Dune had a simultaneous release in theaters and on HBO Max, which was a streaming service and theatrical release so it sort of put a damper on his ticket sales whatever who cares we just want to know about Kyla the Shimame Jenner hopefully they're still going strong and perhaps it makes sense that they want to dodge some media because the paparazzi can be ruthless